they just keep pulling me back in. There's another 1930 Ford Model A. You know, let me see what year precisely. It's a 32. It's a 32. I was gonna say based on these headlights, it was a 1930, but you know, there's no there's no rule that says the stuff has to be original at this age. It's a 1932 Ford Model A, right? It's a Chevy 350 with two four bell carburetors on it. And a tiny little rock air cleaner. And absolutely no wiper blades. So you got to be sure when you drive this car what the weather's going to be. So there's no blades on it. No. Got conventional suspension. Like this grill. Okay. So, suicide doors over here. You can see this roof has been chopped. It's got to be about a good, I don't know, maybe 12 inches. So, you chop the roof. No. All right, <clears throat> this is pretty much it's classic, the classic gauge layout. You know, big ass radials on the back. I like it. The bees are BF. Um, is it Goodrich? It is BF Goodrich. And we are Silvertown Radio 255 7015. And this white wall, and that's got to be about three, three inches, three and a half inches on that white wall. Little painted steel wheel, poverty caps, with the V8 in it, got the chrome trim ring. You know. it's got the recessed LED tail lights in the tail. There's no fenders on this. I would have put fenders on it just because state law with the Exposed wheel and tire assembly. Ah, I don't want to hear it. So, you know, carpeted trunk. <clears throat> Very nice paint. Very nice paint. So if you had the fender, it would screw in under here. You know, like right under there and it screws in and you get some I get some splash protection over here. And in the front, in order for you to use these, you have to put the uh, rest of the sheet metal on here and then attach that to that and this all that other thing. But yeah, 1932 Ford.